intelligence have long since lost power. To find out what's going on, Annie and Baldy decide to take the dinghy to the nearby waters to check. Not long after they leave, David, who is in charge of the seafood, starts to collect the nets for dinner. But to their surprise, it was their captain that David recovered, and there was a bullet hole in his head. It was clear that there was a mole within the group, so he rushes to the archives and finds the unthinkable. It turned out that the supply ship had been involved in an accident months ago, and it was Annie who was on duty at the outpost. Since the watchman was responsible for cleaning up the rubbish at sea, he had every opportunity to do it. Sure enough, when the boat returned, Annie was the only one on board. When confronted by David, Annie confessed to being a spy sent by the enemy. It was she who steered the replacement boat off course. Then she killed all the replacements. The purpose was to gain full control of the nuclear device at the outpost, in order not to let Annie take control of the nuclear weapons. Black pressed the self-destruct mechanism. However, seconds passed and the nuke didn't respond. Only a bunch of codes bouncing around on the screen. Only then did the two men realize that the nuclear weapons at the Sentinel didn't exist. It's just for show to determine